Hello YouTubers out there, welcome to Studio Recall, my name is Jordan. Now you can already probably tell from the title, Ugh, I can't believe I'm doing this for my channel. I'm going family friendly. Uh, now you can definitely, now in definitely majority of my vlogs and probably my other little update series, I do like to use a little bit of creative language I must say. <laughs> throughout some of my videos, so I know that I've been kind of wanting to get a bit of a tame to my lip. You know, use it every now and then, but, you know, in a way tame it, because I use it a bit frequently than I should. And now that YouTube has done this whole, with the ad revenue, with family friendly, you have to be, well, majority of your content, no, not majority, almost all of your content has to be family friendly or else you don't get the, the thing. Now, I'm not earning any money from YouTube, that's going to be like, when I decide to actually sign up for the AdSense program, that's going to be like way, like at least I'm going to start it maybe next year, so I don't, we don't, don't really worry about that, but at the moment, I still need a bit of a, a stepping ground to have that, because if I'm swearing, then, you know, and I'm not doing this for the money, not at all. I should, I'll probably explain more in detail what I'm actually doing Studio Recall for, but I've already said that in the past originally. But at the moment, I'm going to keep the money thing out of it. But at the same time, I kind of want to get a bit of a head start into it when I do decide to actually go into it. I feel like I've explained it a bit wrong, but that's what I'm going to go with. I have to try and... I'm trying to tame myself again. There's a lot of taming going on because I, I speak too long in a lot of my videos. So now that I'm going to go family friendly, I have to think of what I have to say or I have to bleep out if there's any creative language being thrown into my video. So, I have to be careful that. So you'll notice that in a couple, you, you'll be don't, noticing that for more, and, and I cannot believe how it exploded. I believe it started with, well this is rumoured how it started, I don't know if it's fact or false, but uh, apparently it started from an extremely racist video, or like a racist channel that was, I think it pushed the boundaries of what uh, YouTube should allow and what like creators actually should see and that companies were just like no, nope, no, nope, I'm not, no, nope, no, nope, no, nope. I'm not gonna see, I'm not gonna let this product, not letting our product be on this extremely racist video, which I totally understand, I mean, it's completely up to them, I mean, you don't really want to be advertising or selling a product on top of a racist video because then that's gonna look bad for the company. There are a lot of YouTubers who are, who, who are just scraping by with the money they actually earn from that channel. And now that the ads have literally been cut to very slim, a lot of channels are soon going to be dying. So yeah, this is just going to be a really short update series, and seriously, I've wasted a bar of battery f you camera. <laughs> oh, f said I was going family friendly, and I just swore. <laughs> so I haven't done one of these updates in a while, and I kind of wanted to get brush things. Okay, now before Wilson's prom camp, I did make a like, I think like a 30 second long video, like a little quick update with nothing on it, because I believe it was a Sunday night and I was packing for my camp, like I was getting everything ready on the weekend, but then I forgot to record something, I was like, I didn't swear, I was like, fudge, <laughs> fudge, <laughs> uh, we all know what that means, <laughs> I was like, fudge, why are we taking this seriously, fudge, I haven't recorded a video, and I was like, oh, I better make a quick update. And then came Wilson's prom, and then I recorded for the whole week, and oh, that was, that was fun. <laughs> oh, oh. And during that quick little update, I did say about my gaming channel that I was going to create. Now, I am, I'm going to guess, I'm going to roughly estimate it to about, I'm 75% done. I've already created the channel, I've already got all the channel art ready, I've already planned a couple of games I want to record. I just want to get the recording device and I want to actually add a, and I actually want to post like maybe five videos in advance before I actually let on. So what I actually yeah, I said 28 days, that's the rough. So I'm gonna get uh let me think about this. So in maybe four to five weeks, maybe six weeks even. Yeah, six weeks I'll definitely have five videos posted on my channel. I'm not going to tell you the name yet, I have st I'm still haven't done. <laughs> still haven't done. <laughs> now I've explained that, I think I kind of explained why that I wanted to create a gaming channel. It's because that I, I wanted to create more content and that like doing once a week, like once a week is fine, like once a week is good, like, but at the same time, like I, I, I have that hunger just to create. And if I were to post more videos on my channel, I'll need to take more time in my day and out of my study, which I cannot afford. 
So I needed something to be quick, that's something that could be recorded easy, edited easy, and I was like, oh, gaming, that could do. But then like, my previous channel died because of that, because I was terrible, well I wasn't terrible, it's just lack of equipment. I had the creativity, and you can probably definitely tell that a lot of the creativity even bleeds into this channel, that like, some of the edits I do, and a couple of the titling and stuff, and how like, my editing style, like it reflects back on my old channel. And I know if I were to go back into it, I know I could be more efficient, I know I could be more better, and I know I can edit quicker, and I know I can easily do stuff better. And that's what I kind of wanted to do. And oh, what I could have was cringe! Cringe! <laughs> okay, so next week I'm actually going to be doing a product review of a certain product. I'm not going to tell you which because that will be spoilers, and I hate spoilers. Because I've kind of always wanted to get into the whole product review side of things, but I never really got time to actually do it because of school and everything, but now I want to take it a little bit more seriously and see what happens and see if it, see if it floats the boat, see see where it goes. But yeah, that's all I wanted, really wanted to say for this video and the quick update series of what's been happening, what's going to be going on and all that smooth jazz and fam family friendly, Th thumbs up to family friendly. Uh, do, do I even think family friendly is going to last? Probably not. I don't, I don't know if it's going to be a permanent thing of YouTube because I know a lot and a lot of um, channels have been going on Twitch now which is definitely a source of income but like do I consider going on? No. Oh, that, that's right. If, if, I'm go if Studio Recall is going family friendly, will Aussie Dollar go family friendly? No way! <laughs> <laughs> if you if you think family friendly exists on Aussie Dollar, no, I despise that. <laughs> oh, shit, I said the n damn it, and I swear. Ah, oh, <laughs> oh, fudge it. <laughs> I might as well. So basically, the channel I'm literally gonna call it Aussie Dollar. Jordan, why is that sound? That sounds so terrible. Are you racist or something? No, I don't know why. I think the original intent was it for like. The Aussie part, so like in game chat, if I'm doing something like capturing the flag, people in game just be going, something like that, and I was just like, hmm, this this could actually float the boat. And know that it's not so much as the name that kind of counts; it's a character that you portray as. And know that with with this gaming channel, oh boy, it's 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 literally it's gonna be the most Australian slang you're ever gonna see, and it's just gonna be like. Think, think of Jacksepticeye, just just Australian, <laughs> basically. <laughs> and I'm not trying to copy him whatsoever. I mean, just float my boat and know that just whatever comes out of my mouth. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, click the links and annotations for more videos that I post on my channel. Like, comment, and subscribe today. As always, I'll see you in the next video. Bye. <laughs>